Hi everyone, this is Hannah from Kisscraft. So today is for the April release and it's just a part of the release. And then the second part will be yeah a few more days later. Yeah, and first I want to say sorry for the noise in the background. Yeah, the outside is making the road. So yeah, I just can't avoid that. So sorry, bear with me of that. Yeah, and then let's come to the release. So the first one I'd like to share is three pinwheels. So you will get three sizes in the set. So you can see it has all these tiny, elegant edge around the corner. And these are the pieces so you can make the layering piece on top. And these are the examples I made. So you got three sizes. And you just need a bread to connect the part. And then I also add a store, paper store of it. But yeah, my store is a little big, I think. And then for the center, I use the animal dots on the center. Yeah, I think that is super cute. The next one is our A2 mailbox. So this is the set and you've got several flowers and leaves inside. And then you also get the word happy mail. And let me show you what I made. So this is the box and you can put your A2 card inside. So you can put your barky card inside, three-dimensional card inside. And I add these flowers here. So these flowers and leaves are from this set. And you open it like this. So it looks like this. It's an envelope box and it curls like this so when you made it you just cut this piece one time and these two pieces two times to make the signs and then glue them together and then close it like this so it's very simple to do this box and the next one is this boba tea shaker so you have a big size and this is the small version so let me show you what's inside you got this is the big backing piece and this is the piece to make the shaker part and then this is the store and this is the lid over here and then you have all these parts to make the topper and you can decorate your topper into three different animals and this is the backing piece over here like the mm, drinking like the tea that is flowing inside your inside your bottle and these are the shaker parts shaker base that you can make it into boba those yeah i think you know those so i think that is super cute and let me show you so it has three uh, two sizes and i have made these three animals so you will get a panda and then this is a normal bear and this is a polar bear just change the size uh, change the color so you have different bells and then so from here, you can see the size difference. They are super cute. And then I make those, I stick those boba beads. Uh, I don't know how to call that, but I, I, uh, I stick these on the background. So it stick like this. And then I add some shaker base over here. And then I add the straw here. I think that is super cute and this is this one and also this one 
yeah i just love love these i think these are very very cute right yeah definitely my favorite one in this release and the next one is this small frosting uh piping tool yeah uh, last year we have a bigger version and this is a small version and let me show you yeah this is how it looks like and i add a tiny bowl over here very cute and the size is very good and then we have this set this is a mix of cookies you have different cookies in the set and i will show you what i made so i made a lot yeah i'm not good at cooking actually but i'm really enjoying making these cookies so yeah this is the first one yeah sorry that you can see that my hands is so dirty <laughs> yeah just because i i'm using the ink over the cardstock so yeah my hands get dirty and yeah and then i add add those novel jobs over here to make it pop up like real cookies and let me show you what dye i use i use this one so i just cut it on the cardstock and then cut it again on the foam to make it three-dimensional like real cookies and then add normal drops over these tiny dots yeah i think that's super cute and then let me show you this one so for this one is using these two dies this is the backing piece and this is the one that actually it cuts all these tiny bits out and then you need to stick them on it and then i use the nouveau drops that i just icing it on the top yeah i think that is very cute i also use the foam to make it like real cookie and then this is this one it has these tiny uh, these embossing lines over here yeah it look like this and then i have this one and this cookie is made from this these two pieces. just layer this on top of this one and i also add icing on top and here is this one so this one i also use those I also use the Nuvo Draw. Yeah, I add over here just like what I did, like this one. So it's using this cutting die. And then, so for this one, is this one. And I use these two pieces. So this is for making the backing piece, and this is used to cut out. Yeah. So you can see it more clearly and then for let me see for this part i use these two these two pieces this is the make the background and this is make the top part yeah it looks like this i also use i use the pink drops over and then i put some embossing powder over it like uh how to call it, like those yeah I, I think you know what i mean yeah and then i add some frosting frosting glitter on the edge yeah i like this one and then for this one it's made out of this and this piece so these are the two pieces that you can use to create this one yeah i add a heart on top yeah and i add those embossing powder over and then you have you leave the one two three these two these three dies that is to make the heart cookies see so for the, you have this embossing line along the heart and 
I just add the icing over uh, around the embossing line and for this one it looks like this yeah because you have a bigger frame and a small frame so for the big frame you make it as the background and the little frame to make it on the top and I layer it two times I'm not clear if you can see it clearly but I make I layer it two times to make a, it a little dimensional like real cookies that is pop up and also for the heart see I layer it two times I just cut two times of the heart and layer it on top so it will be a little higher than the normal place and then it will also pop up a little like real cookies so I just try my best to make it look like real cookies and so hope you like them it's quite a big set and I think that is super cute to add on your cars yeah just like sending cookies to your friends very cute so hope it like real cookies i'm really enjoy making these i think they are super fun to make and then we have these two nesting frames yeah so you have a plain one and this is a stitched one they match perfectly and it has 12, I think it's 12 circles in the set, so you got 24 circles. Yeah, they are great for making the cut base. Yeah, I didn't cut yet, but I want to show you. And the next one is our new set, is for the sweets. So it has the word sweet, delicious, yummy, and a treat for you. So this one says yummy and this one is delicious with those heart on top is so cute and this one is a treat for you and then you also got a sweet and I have used it on my uh, cotton candy so it's the sweet the next one is this cotton candy shaker so you got the face and this is the bowl and this is another bowl that you can use and you have all these uh, wood green embossing pattern over here and the size is very great and let me show you what I made so first I make these two they have the face on the top and it has all the bowls like so and then I also made another two this is the one that I has the word I choose you here and I add a tiny bow over here so this is this one and then I made this one it says the word sweet and I add some ephemera over here this is a heart shaped strawberry I think that is sweet yeah so I love this one the size is great the next one is a cute bell set you have all these decoration has to decorate your bear and you can see here the heart it has tiny hearts over here on the ear I think that is super cute and you have the uh, glasses and these are the parts to decorate and you also have this topper and these are things that she can have she can hold on her hands and I made four examples so I think they are super super cute so these are the two and I just used the pen to draw the eye or inside I think that is cute and I add animal dots over here to make her cheeks and these are the top hot topper and then she's holding a coffee cup and I add a tiny heart animal dots here and this why he's holding she's holding the xoxo heart super cute right and then for these two they are having the the glasses yeah and see the the nose is a little different these two nose you have this big one and then you have this small one to carry the 
the glass glasses i think that's that is cute and then you have the uh, donut and also a letter and you can put your letter yeah slide it inside this piece so it's this one and this one you have this uh, this slit so you can slide your letter inside this envelope yeah i think that is very cute and the next one is this cutting board tag in the tag you will have this cutting board and you have this embossing line around it and also this is a stitching part so very detailed and then you have the words baked with love and cooked with love and also a heart and a bow in the set yeah the size is very handy that you can use to add on your baking projects to your friends and so this is how it look like you add the heart here and it says baked with love and it this one it says cooked, cooked with love and i add a add a eyelet over here and yeah i'm thinking of uh, adding some dangerines over here yeah i think that is cute the next one is a pizza actually and it has this heart on the top and then you got the words you got a pizza my heart yeah and this is the pizza that i made yeah you have this tiny heart over the top on, on the top yeah i think that is cute and you got these words so let me show you how it cut out yeah. seems i missed seems i'm missing my u yeah it has a u but yeah i just can't find it right now but you can see the font yeah i love this font always my favorite font and the next one is a tiny hot ice cream you have this to decorate your cream and yeah uh, let me show you what i made i just made one example so you can see how it layers together and you if you can you can cut it more times to layer it on top yeah i think that is also cute and i add these sprinkles over this is a very cute size to add on your embellishment and the next one is a watermelon shaker you have these cute ends and this is to there's watermelon seeds so yeah you can make it into a shaker and this is what i made i think this is super cute yeah to add on your summer projects and the next one is this strawberry set in the set you got two sizes of strawberries and all these are to decorate your strawberry and you also have these two is for making the coating part of your strawberry so this is the big size and this is the small size i made it like the chocolate coated strawberry and this is what it how it looks like when without the coating part and then we have this one so this is our atc stamp and the matching die set so you got this stamp that you can stamp it at the back side of your atc card so i love this pattern and you have different uh, frames to make the card base of your atc card and i made three as an example yeah my first time to make the atc card yeah try my best so for this one yeah it looks like this this is the shape you have all this stitching line over. 
so cute and for the back side it looks like this and then for this one it looks like this and then here you can see how it stamped and this is the, another one and it looks like so and last but not least we also have this stamping foam yeah so you can create reverse so you can use this to, to create any uh, image that you want to stamp as the background of your card yeah it can see it can uh how to say that it can stamp any shape any image you want as the stencil so these are the new things in the store and we will be having more new products yeah i think in about one week so stay tuned and if you have any questions please leave me comment i will answer you as soon as possible and thank you for watching and have a nice day bye bye